is your first Alert 5 weather with Mike Daniels. Always nice to have you with us here on News 5 at 5. Live downtown Colorado Springs, sunset over the Rockies. We've got high thin clouds out there. Still pretty comfortable at 41 degrees. That's live from downtown Pueblo, 39 degrees. A few high thin clouds as well. Traffic flowing smoothly northbound and southbound on Monument Hill right now. Here's what I'm watching for you. Storm system across the northwestern section of the United States. Pushing some high clouds here across the home state. That thing bringing much need to rainfall to the northwest, even some snow to the northern Rockies. We're going to see a little bit of snow here in Colorado late in the week, but a better chance, I think, by Monday is seeing some snow here across the viewing area. Tomorrow, though, if you're a warm weather fan, you'll want to get out and soak it up. It's going to be the warmest day we'll have for at least the next seven days. Downslope flow out ahead of that Pacific cold front. It will be breezy at times tomorrow. Also going to be mild 60s across a part of southeastern Colorado for those afternoon high temperatures tomorrow. We're going to start with 30s and 40s by 9 a.m. Temperatures warm nicely by the lunch hour. Take a look at this lunch outside. Certainly not out of the question when it's that warm in January. Going to see these clouds really start to thicken up from mid to uh, late afternoon around here. Those clouds not going to produce any moisture anywhere across southeastern Colorado. Wind really is going to be the feature attraction. Just breezy tomorrow. Then as that cold front crashes through here early on Thursday, wind will really start to ramp up Thursday. Not out of the question. See gusts from 35 to maybe 45 miles per hour. This model brings the strongest wind from the Pikes Peak region all the way out to the far eastern plains. Outside right now, updated temperatures 30s and 40s across a good chunk of the News 5 viewing area. Low temperatures tonight, not too terribly bad for this time of year. Pueblo, you had a low this morning. In the single digits tonight, 18 in the springs, relatively mild for January at 27 degrees. Afternoon highs tomorrow. Take a look at that way above normal. It's always good to be warmer than normal during the month of January. Colorado Springs as a result of that cold front. We're almost 20 degrees colder on Thursday, and with that strong wind blowing, it's going to feel even colder than 40 degrees. So good day to stay occupied indoors, I think. Continued windy on Friday could see a a stray flurry move across the area on Saturday. It's a long shot at this point. Then better chance, I think, of seeing some snow by next Monday. Right now, just one on the storm impact scale. In Pueblo, afternoon high temperatures fall off rather dramatically by Thursday. It's going to be windy Thursday and Friday. Not a bad weekend for this time of the year. Developing storm could possibly bring snow by next Monday. It's a long way off. We're on top of it. We'll keep everybody posted. And for Canyon City, a real warm day tomorrow. You fall off into the mid 40s by Thursday, staying into the 40s all the way through Tuesday of next week. And in Woodland Park, I've got you dry, really mild tomorrow. Enjoy that while you can. Wind really fires up Thursday, sticks around Friday. A stray flurry possible Saturday, then a better chance of seeing some snow by Monday. That's it for now.